of you and you. you. So, we are at the Elephant Nature Park just outside of Chiang Mai and we have come here with some friends so that we can have a look at the elephants in somewhere that is actually ethical. Did your mum make that? <laughs> what did you say, Jeff? Did your mum make that? <laughs> I don't know if you can see, I will zoom in. But it's a crocheted blanket. I, I reckon she did. <laughs> So they don't just have elephants, they've got dogs that they rescue, cats, horses, buffalo, bunnies, and of course. So some of the elephants that are here have got bad teeth, which is why they peel the watermelon. I think that's super cute. All their snacks. The elephant by nature to relax on here, that's okay, but not go down there. Yeah. Not go downstairs. Sometimes you can see elephant go to the river. Sometimes you can see elephant mud bath over there. <laughs> mm. This is like a special place. Okay, so we've just had a tour about these two elephants, and these are the two very, very gentle elephants. Uh, one of them is 70 years old, and I think they're called Picta and Kubaji. I'm sure I'm not saying their names right, but they say they're very gentle, and even though we can't touch the elephants, we can stand by these and say hi. This one, her name Pikun about 6 years old. This one's called Picton, she's 65. And this other elephant here is 70, 75 years old. Available for them while you have to put a peeling tube. Like a watermelon without the skin, one to get help. Like an old people. Old people. You want to know how feeling, how the pigs are what did it feel like? Wrinkly. Like leathery. Aww. They have 116 elephants here that have all been rescued from different parts of Thailand. So whether it's Bangkok or Chiang Mai, and it's all come from people that have mistreated them or abused them even. But you know, the fact that they have been mistreated or misused and they are so gentle, it's absolutely incredible. Feet, would you like, like to wash your hand over there? Oh, okay. <laughs> this was the elephant that I have just fed. Luna and Jen have, Luna, we tried to get her to sleep on the way. Did she? No, she didn't. But she, they're having a nap now, hopefully. Um, but we've just fed, Bodhi and I have just fed this elephant that you can see behind me. Um, I'm glad they've got the screen. <laughs> um, and her name is Full Moon. Yeah, that would have been lovely if Luna would have fed it, but never mind. She needed a sleep. Oh, bye bye, full moon. So at night they go into their little houses. The sand for their bed. They don't get chained up. They their doors do get shut. And there's little chimneys for their fire. These are the fires. It's cute. So Bodie's fast asleep. And. Luna, let's see. Let's see if Jen managed to get her to sleep. What a 
one sleeping Luna. Would you like a coffee? So the coffee here, it all comes back to the elephants. So make sure you get a coffee if you come. And the same, they've got some coffee for sale. And they've also got a little gift shop. So just over here. And everything comes to here, um, they were saying. So yeah, this is a nice little. We'll get Luna a little little teddy elephant probably. Um, but yeah, it's all. And there's also here, and this is what they relied on on COVID time. So they relied on AI. You know, basically no visitors are allowed to come so they relied on sponsors so thank you all of these sponsors for helping some little facts there's a little fact board but i've always like wondered what's the difference between an african and an asian elephant um so this is saying so the ears is a big factor so the african elephant have African shaped ears. How cool is that? And I'm going to show you the picture of it, but actually, yeah, now they've said it, it really does. Um, and the other elephant, so the Asian elephant, have smaller round ears. The trunks are different. Again, I'll show you a picture. Have two fingers to grasp on the African elephant, and on the Asian elephant, have a one finger grasp. The heads are single dome for the African elephant and the heads on the Asian elephant are twin dome. How was the cats? There was a, there was a tiny, there was a tiny one. like stubby one and it had like a tongue sticking out, uh, tiny tongue. <laughs> so we have come back from lunch, we had an amazing lunch, loads of salad, loads of veg, loads of curries and now we are going to the river to watch the elephants be bathed and then we're also going to see uh, baby elephants as well. We'll show you what we see. They're saying are very cheeky and we have to be very alert and very aware because this one over here has just stolen the hose pipe oh and they're both doing it now So these cheeky little elephants got the hose and now there is a water feature. So these little babies have literally, from the burst water pipe that's over there, just created themselves a river to play in. So look, now they have a river. So the babies next to the little water fountain and now having a wrestling match. And here comes the mummers to sort it all out. Ah, oh, hi baby. Here at the sanctuary they only have Asian elephants and actually the Asian elephants are the ones that are in um, Sri Lanka, in India, in Thailand, everywhere. So this is what they have here, the Asian elephants. So on this one they show us some of the elephants before and after. So this is Meadow before, she was worked really really hard and now, this is her now, 
Maybe they're nice and happy. Problem, like accident. And at the country. By the border from the uh, human army. Ha, we are at the Elephant Nature Park. In uh, where? In Kosa. Chiang Ch Ch nice. Mai. And we've had an amazing day. We have uh, watched them go in the river. We have uh, seen baby elephants causing I <coughs> mischief. I got to feed one. Did you? I missed that bit. What were you doing when mummy was feeding elephants? Shh. Shh. Sleeping. Sleep. <laughs> but yeah, this place is really nice how they actually look after the elephants. So we would definitely recommend it. We will put a link down below on um, where you can get tickets and everything for the elephants. Oh, Luna's off. Um, but yeah, so guys, if you have liked this and you want some more stuff on family travel and where to go, don't forget then, to subscribe. And thumbs up and, do, and ring the bell. Ring the bell. Ring the 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 